All right. Hey. Hey, we're, we're, we're live. How is everyone? How are we holding up? How are we doing? Also, who's here? I see some names I really like to see around here when I look at the, uh, when I look at the banner. It's interesting to say the least. Whew. Yeah, we, we all have those. Um, so first off, I want to formally apologize for like... For just like... Straight up not doing this at a real time. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you to Nero for resubscribing for three months in a row with the message... <laughs> A 
also, yeah, I swapped around the emotes a little bit. Um, I got a little bit of news before I can actually get into the game. Um, A, I can now actually start planning my debut. Uh, the model is... The model is completely set up. Hold on, I want to... I never gave you permission to give me notifications. Um, so, debut is ready to set up. I don't know when I want to do it because I'm, I'm actually still deliberating if I want to wait until Coco's graduation. Like, legitimately. Um, I know it's a little silly, but like... I don't know how open the schedule actually is. Um, but the model's completely set up and everything. Um, like, th there's some small kinks with it that I can work out in the meantime. Uh, I'm probably going to be starting a small retweet game to do a model reveal when I actually have a date set up. Um... And if any VTubers are currently watching, I am in. I am still considering a thing where I promote some of y'all. Um. For for a completely in character kayfabe thing. Um. shit brain fried uh because like the first thing that i wanted to do was like i wanted to choose okay what game do i want to play on my debut when i actually get into the game because it's going to be a lot of just chatting at the start and then there's going to be a game uh we're getting into wrestling territory i use wrestling terminology to talk about business shit all the time like i am constantly in a face in a, in a state of soft kayfabe. Um, because it makes more sense. I'm pretty sure if you looked at idle terminology and wrestling terminology and combine them together, you would get VTuber terminology. Um, so yeah. There's probably going to be more shit that I'm going to be talking about setting up. Um. Uh, I'll, I'll shop around. I'll talk to other VTubers I might have a hold of. Maybe get a grip with how the community is feeling about, like, new people coming in. While there's, like, such a big fucking... We've got this big fucking person on a pedestal that is graduating. And it's like... Okay... But is now a good time? I'm not sure yet. Um, so I'm trying to figure that all out. While also... Doing all this shit. Um, but like... Debut game was chosen, like, immediately. Cause I'm like, okay, well, well now I have it in my hands. Um, which... Only a handful of people know what it is, and if you know, stay shut. Stay quiet. Um. But I think it will be very, very fitting. Um, either way, let's let's boot up Killer7. I really like the song Children of the Omnissiah. I'm glad that I apparently owned the OST to Mechanicus. Or, correction, I own a copy. You don't know shit and or fuck. Also, Nero is my dad. My VTuber dad. So, there's that. Okay. So, give me a second to remember where the most recent save file is. Uh, I also want to apologize for, like, the handful of days of inactivity. Either way. Let's get into this. 
He is dead. Yes. He is. He is dead. He is. He's daddy. <clears throat> I never want to say that again. Also, let me just keep my phone to the side. This is your daughter, motions to Bedlam, who is way taller. Okay, but the question is, how way taller? Also, we're gonna have to rewatch all of these cutscenes. I remember Twitch was being fucky during cutscenes, but I'm gonna be a lot less quiet. But like, how tall are you, Nero? You're like 5'3", she's like 5'10", 5'11", and has three inches of boot. <laughs> so she's like 6'1", 6'2". Oh, this scene. Oh, this is uncomfortable. What was that? Do I sense regrets? Perhaps. Her Pepe hands. Just like that. Didn't you notice the dead bodies behind you? Huh? Your folks. No. You're lying. Your wife's name is. Pepe. God, this game has such a weird setup. I also don't know how long I want to go today for obvious answers. Reminder, GameCube exclusive for, for the longest time. This is dialogue that I didn't that I don't remember being on the fucking PS2. Do you feel the hate swelling? That hate that comes from your grudge. It's merely a reflection of you. Ask yourself, Pedro. How many children have you killed? Mary? You mean your little girl, Mary? Mary, where is she? Ah, right here. God, this scene's raw as fuck. And I mean like raw in the, in every definition of it. God fucking Oh, this is one of my favorite fucking like This isn't in my top 10 like favorite games ever, but this is definitely one of my favorite games. Which is so weird if you hear this and you look at the other parts of me just struggling. Uh, come on. Uh, let's get out of here. Yeah. Poor kid. I fucking love Garcian. He's great. He's just an innocent little child. I know. That's atrocious, ain't it? Murder. Murder is okay. Murder is okay. Ambush in Blackburn's residence. Assignment number 37. Get rid of the assassin Chris Blackburn. Or Curtis Blackburn. Oh, I can't read. Also, I noticed like two people left after that cutscene, and I don't blame them. Iwazari, what do you got for me? Master? That won't do. That just won't do at all. There's just no excuse. How could you let a kidnapper get away alive? I must be more strict. I must stay vigilant. In the name of Harmon, gonna lurk a bit, setting up some audio stuff, but still want to give you that view. Fair enough. If if you wanna if you wanna help me cheat the system, um, you can watch this stream at fifteen percent and above audio, and it'll work. It'll still count as a view. Twitch is weird, but also it can't tell when you mute. Twitch through your, um, through your browser instead of through the audio thingy, apparently. He was R, what do you got for me? 
Master? That won't do. You must sometimes use a carrot. There's something very important, I must say. Just between you and me. You know, off the record. White hair is a neurotic fellow. This house may look normal. But it is actually protected by very heavy security. You have to pretty you'll have to proceed carefully. Which calls for four eyes. Always better safe than sorry. Okay, so we switch to Kevin. In the name of Harmon. Okay. Is a gimp giving you advice? Oh, have you not sat in for any of the other streams? Oh, oh, you are in for a ride if you don't know shit about Killer7. You have not. Oh, you missed her fucking an old man then. Like, on camera, it was actually really gratuitous without showing anything. It's also unclear how old she is, but it, from what I hear, sounds like college age. <laughs> what the fuck is Kevin? He's old. He's old. <laughs> Wait. Oh, we don't have Kaede. But we do have Mask. Is there someone behind me? Thank God I saw ya. Bullshit. Alright, switch to... Kevin? But yeah, Nero, you'd fucking love this game. Master? That won't do. Not at all. It's entirely inefficient. You fail to understand that your job is to nail white hair. You should be prepared to give your life to take his. Light hair isn't gonna wait around for ya. Only the Hellion can destroy the core. In the name of Harmon. Who would the Hellion be of all of all the guys we have? You would? Yeah, so I think this game is like 10 bucks on Steam? 10 to 20? Locked from the other side. Dan is Hellion? I believe that. Oh yeah. I can absolutely see how Dan is the one that needs to be here. Okay, so Dan is the Hellion, Coyote is the Thief, sometimes the Eagle. But yeah, I encourage everyone to buy Killer7 if they can warrant it. <laughs> PC version's a bit borked, but like, literally nothing that can't be either worked around or fixed, as far as I'm aware. Like, when it's, when I say it's borked, it's just kind of bare bones. It's not like No More Heroes, where it's actually, like, buggy. I'm, I'm a cleaner. cleaner. Yes. Well, the good news is, Dan may be dead. But, A, death isn't exactly permanent, and B, we, he already got the objective done, I just <laughs> fucked up. Head open. Son of a bitch. So no head? <laughs> Son of a bitch. Reloading? God, I wish there was someone with a similar kit to Garcin without me having to die to play as Garcin. 
like... I like Garcin's pistol. Look, I'm a cleaner. Okay. Time to resurrect Dan. Alright. So let's select Dan again. Er, actually, no. Because first off, deposit our blood. Um, and then go to Khan, because I like him, because he's fast. Careful of that Windows key. I actually turned off what happened last time, or at least I should have. I think I did. I think I fixed it. Speaking of which, um, for reference, if you don't like that Windows shows you the weather and shit, uh, you can stop that from displaying by, uh, there should be a new thing that pops up when you right-click the taskbar. Fuck you. Did we at least take the soul shell? <laughs> I'm gonna be irate if we didn't. We didn't. Oh. Well, that just won't do. Mm. Hello, motherfucker. Fuck you. You hated that weather shit. Did you find it? <laughs> you know what's behind the salt in the immigration office? Pedro monopolized the market. Before, the rule was the old man had the girls, Pedro had the boys. That was until Pedro broke it. It's a big business in orphans, but there was a shortage in fresh organs. Having smile caused the birth rate to drop more rapidly. Increases in contagious diseases started eating away at bodies. And voila! Control of the market on boys is no longer enough. That's why Pedro betrayed the old man. Pedro can run, but he can't hide. I feel like I have a new voice for Travis every time. Like, I'll always have the same vague sound for Iwazaru. Uh, except the one time that I refused to write what he said. Fuck you. Ah, there you are. Master, that won't do. That won't do at all. Give it some thought. Don't repeat the same mistake. Did you already forget the crack? Thank goodness. The mask works wonders here. Recall the skill of the mask in the name of Harmon. Yes, you feel like a dad that doesn't know anything about tech and your kid is showing you how to use the Google? Yo, yeah, maybe I should... You motherfucker. <laughs> Maybe you should wear shirts with random words on. Travis definitely rocks it, so why can't you? Do it. I dare you. Ah, shit. Let's get someone who can actually aim in here. Crack in the wall, huh? Where's the crack in the wall that he was talking about? <laughs> Ooh, carrier pigeon. Is it from pussy this time? No, it's from Xenia. Dear Amir, I tend to be, to be a little stubborn. Even so, you'll probably forgive me. Of course you will, since you're the one who hasn't paid me. You'll pay me for every last dollar one way or the other, I assure you. I'll crush your palpitating heart in the palm of my hand. I'll bend your wings backward. Her name is Susie Sumner. Or Sumner. She's a loose cannon with a vicious criminal intent. 
She was apprehended under nat the National Watch program, but killed several of the program directors. After requesting work from the Smith Syndicate, she was eliminated. The boy's name is Kess Bloody Sunday. And, like his namesake, he was killed on Sunday. His criminal tendencies were such that even the Smith Syndicate were reluctant to kill him at first. The boy was a remorseless killer, born with murderous tendencies and a latent talent to construct complex bombs. The informant's name is Yun Hyun. He's the owner of the Union Hotel Group. He met an untimely death at the Union Hotel in Philadelphia. Many celebrities were at the reception, but nevertheless, there were a few witnesses to the murder, and many of the facts don't add up. Yet one thing is for sure. He was involved with the Smith Syndicate. Rumor is that it was an incident that happened at the hotel, and it was swept conveniently under the rug. The remnant psyches surrounding the Smith Syndicate have come together, and every last one of them is a hard-boiled criminal. Members of the Smith Syndicate are not ordinary killers. They're superhuman monsters that consider psychos fair game. I'll contact you just one more time. Johnny Gagnon. Okay, so that explains why we see Yun all the time. Let's just deposit the blood we have. <laughs> Ooh, shit. Who we got? Let's hope that's actually wrong person, but it worked for me. Oh, I gotta get used to have the knife feels to throw. Locked from the other side. Wasn't the other pool door locked from the other side? Okay, that was just a shower head, not like a crack in a wall. Fucking go. Hey. By the way, Nero, you say you're like a you're like a confused dad who doesn't understand technology, but like hear me out. Hear me out. Okay, I'm wearing the wind ring. You are technically now my dad. <laughs> Windring howls. Ooh. Ooh, is that a fucking bullet? Goddamn right it is. Oh, goddamn. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, that actually got me. Okay, we need Dan. Sorry if I alternate between quick swapping and not quick swapping, but like... I need to sometimes know for sure I'm gonna swap to the right guy. Security. It's a security device. So, Kevin, right? Oh no, that's Khan. Yeah, this is why I don't want to do it on the fly every single time. Because a lot of the killers have, like... It's a security device. It's weird that we can't push it. Oh well. A protector ZZ smile. Let me guess. Master, that won't do. You're doing it all wrong. Well, at this point... You probably would rather not hear me say that. I'll just stay out of your way. Remember, 
there's a ring for extinguishing flame. In the name of Harmon. Okay. Actually, just give me Khan for this, because I think Khan is also the guy that's useful for... I think he's going to be the guy that's useful for taking care of the, prote the Protector ZZs. <laughs> Although... I'd rather have Dan to take this single one out. This is too easy. Get Dan to do that. Get Mask to do this. Oh, fuck. Um. Okay, just a single bomb, that's fine. Oh, because you're the protector, ZZ. Alright, so it's two. It's two. Okay, Z's is one. The regular protector, the protector smiles are zero charges. And the ZZ's are two charges with Khan. And they're all color-coded with varying uh, designs anyways, so it should be easy enough for me to remember. I'm gonna move my mic a little. Hmm. <laughs> I got just the guy for you. Make up a guy! Motherfucker, I am the guy! <laughs> Fuck you! <gasps> oh shit. <laughs> what do you got for me, Yoon? Mr. Smith? I sell information, yes? It's only natural. It's time for me to sleep. So, I stay on guard. Shoot the mask to hear more. But the mask lusts for thick blood. Okay, so I don't know if I need help yet. Wait, I have a time ring. What the fuck am I doing here? It's time for me to sleep. <laughs> that's me, Nero. You know that's me. Fuck you. Oh, I'm slowly I'm slowly understanding everything Suda does. That man, he knows what he's doing. Okay, um, I didn't mean to do that, but noted. Wait, pull. Okay. I sure could use a light. Like, maybe the fire ring? Ooh. Okay, we need to wake up Coyote then. I'll just have to get to the next Harmon room. Mad Streams is raiding with a party of five. Holy shit. Howdy. Um, actually two seconds. Cause y'all reminded me of something. I didn't get a message for that. What the fuck? What the fuck, alert box? Is there just no alert for raids? Oh. Hold on. This is an easy fix. <laughs> Alert box be like, oh yeah yeah you I feel I feel. Oh no. 
Oh, I suddenly dropped frames. Okay, how is everyone from the alert? How is everyone? While I while I do a hot fix on this, I think this should be easy enough. Should be easy enough to fix. Also, howdy, Mads. I don't see you around here much. Raids. Oh, for some reason it was disabled. I think there was something... Uh, with a party of, there we go. Now it's an event. It's disabled by default for those 2000 average viewer channels or something. Yeah, but I don't drop, I don't drop. 2,000 average. That'd be nuts. But I don't do that. Also, I need to... That's gonna bother me. How's everyone doing? Cute alert? Thank you. I actually kind of want to fix it up a little more uh, after I debut. Which should be soon. Now... <laughs> Get. God, that is a number I'm not used to seeing around here. I really like, I really like this environment. I like it too. Like, you don't see environments like this super often. <laughs> no, I don't want to talk to Travis. You're just gonna give me the same advice as last time. <laughs> nope. Uh, what were you doing before this, Mance? Firing howls. What? Okay, that's not what I meant to do. But it'll do. The Odd Craving. Dark Souls 3? Oh, fuck yeah. That game rules. I plan to do that eventually. I just... Fuck you. I need a new SSD before I can do that. But I do own it on PC your first playthrough and you've died a fuck ton. Yeah, that's Dark Souls 3. You try to get yourself a katana and then some motherfucker pushes you off a cliff in his underwear. Security terminal. Hold on. Time ring? I don't know. Sounds like you're kind of night. Yeah, yeah. Nah. I also need to get the, uh... Oh, that's a puzzle. Okay. Careful of the parking position. Um... Mr. Smith? I sell information, yes? It's so easy. Line up nine cars in the garage. Shoot the mask to hear more. But the mask lusts for thick blood. Yeah, I'm, I'm running into the issue where everything I want to play... Um... Okay. Well, how do I... How do I move the cars around is the... Okay. Okay. And I... Okay. This should be easy. Love the way the main character runs. That's just one of them. Hey! Alright, puzzle done! I'm a genius. There's... That color coding was a red herring and a half. Oh! That's probably going to be an electricity ring, ain't it? Hello there, Smith. Muggy tonight, isn't it? Rather exhilarating, isn't it? The perfect night. For a summer date. He rolled up his favorite custom bike. Of course, it's all a secret from Mom and Dad. 
He quietly parks the bike in front of the house and tiptoes over to my window. I even have my shoes ready so I can slip out from the second floor. It's the perfect escape plan. Er, he throws the rock to signal me, but it smashed straight through the window and square on my head. Now that really pissed me off. Daddy's hunting rifle just happened to be sitting in my room. With blood trickling into my eyes, I couldn't see too well. But his head getting sh shot straight off? Yeah, I remember that quite vividly. Brain spurted out like cottage cheese. Oh, you forgot this, didn't you? The power ring. And by power, it means, like, electricity. I had to move soon after that. My new room was, uh, all white. Quite an antiseptic space with almost nothing at all inside. A woman in white looked after me. Day after day. I believe we called the room... Solitary Confinement? The final stop for killers. God, I love how she just talks in Kaomoji. That's a wet what a wacky story. Yeah. My precious power ring gone forever. Yep. Okay. I have a feeling there's something more to the security terminal. Cuz if it's not a power ring. Okay, what if it's a water ring? No. Well, if it... Hmm. God. Thanks for reminding me of that fucking He-Man clip pitches. I saw the fucking uh, Limit Breakers video about it. Super recently. Fucking Limit Breakers was such a weird channel for me because I didn't like them until until I found one video, and now I'm like, oh hell, hell yeah, old man, tell me about who has the most health. Fucking Ura, Devil Man. But yeah, I don't think I actually gave you a proper thanks. Um, Mads, sorry, I, I giggled like halfway through the sentence. Th thank you for the raid, sincerely. It's all right. I know it's all right, but still. Okay. Feel my. Don't make me see it. I feel my blood. So I actually want to wake Khan up. Does it cost anything to wake him up? Doesn't seem to. What the fuck are you looking at? Fuck him. All right. Wait, no, I don't want abilities. I want skills. Uh, let's just upgrade everything on him because he's like he is super useful. Channel's cool, and you wanted to show it off. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! I try to put on the best show I can, which is why I didn't do anything yesterday. Um, well, actually, now that it's no longer s Friday, um... I feel my blood rushing through my body. Yes, this is it. The feeling, it's coming back to me. No regrets. The sensation of killing. No, no regrets has followed. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Welcome to the cabaret. Yeah, I'll just set them on fire. But yeah, nah, nah. It's it's a hundred percent. It's a hundred percent. All right. What the fuck are you looking at? I feel my. Don't make me say it again. I feel my blood. Whoop. But yeah. <laughs> nah. I'm just doing my best.
Oh, fuck, right. Well, now that we have Coyote on our... Well, we always had Coyote on our side, but now that we have him awakened, we can unlock the pool area. Let's keep going. Stop birthing. Stop it. Let me just make sure. Yep. There we are. So if we hit the passage, go to the pool room, use Coyote, we'll be able to unlock it. Yeah, I know we need we need a light, which I don't entirely understand what that means. Because, like, it also leads me to assume that the actual pool can... is something that can be fucked with. Wait, is Coyote 4? He is. Okay. There we are. Can still can't get over how the fucking padlocks look. They look amazing. <laughs> fucking love this area's track. Like... <laughs> It's... there's something about it. And I can't quite place it. I think I just like somber piano. It's a security device. Alright. So now we swap to Kevin. Road? Uses invisibility. <laughs> Flick a knife into the green spot. Switch to mask. Adios. Reload. Just wanted to drop by the raid folks, but you're gonna head out some night. Hope the rest of my stream is pog. Well, it certainly should be if people stick around, keep talking. If they're if they're from your neck of the woods, they're probably really cool. And I'm probably gonna spread the wealth after the stream. Depending on if anyone is currently live. <laughs> That's always the caveat. Of like Unless there's no one around. Because, like, I stream late. Night? Good night. God, I would totally use this area's save room music for my intro playlist. Wait. Adios. Nice. Oh, that feels great. Security system is currently on. All right, so we just gotta find a way to turn it off. Ain't no problem. Just a little bit of puzzle solving. I say, understanding that this game's puzzles are bullshit. Sometimes. Night, good night. Yeah, I... <laughs> so I know Matt uh, lives vaguely in the same time zone as me, so it's like, knowing that she was even streaming right now is like, what? Hey. Eh? Fuck 
granted, if you're a streamer, you probably do not have the best sleep schedule in the world. But that's okay. That means you can entertain people who don't have the best sleep schedule in the world. Ooh. I think this is where we might want the time ring. Could have sworn I saw a clock around here. Yes. All right, that was easier than it seemed. <laughs> I'm fucked, aren't I? Whoop. Fuck you. Whoop up. Get. <laughs> Fuck you. Let's go. Let's actually investigate this room first. The time ring howls, but what will this give me? Oh, fuck yeah. I knew coming back around here wasn't a mistake. Bullet. <laughs> Where? Okay. Fuck you. Let's keep going. <laughs> Wait, no. We want to go this way. <laughs> Reload. I was gonna say, go on, I dare you, keep going. Swap to Mask the Smith. See? Easy as pie. Coyote might be useful in the next coming room. If we're looping back around to where I think we're looping back around, we'll need to unlock something. Oh, you motherfucker. You're back? All right, round two, motherfucker. Good! Okay. Wait, no. Not Kaede. Not Kaede. I want Khan. And maybe the power ring. Okay. I'm feeling like we may need the power ring because... Alright. Yeah, you weren't so bad when it was... Or, you were fucking awful to fight when it was just Garcian. But now summon more of your speed. Come on, just try to fight me. I dare ya. Woo. All right, you're good, you're good. At least up to speed with me. Yeah, you were really tanky last time we fought. But now, now that I can just spam you with bullets, it ain't a problem. 
you're probably missing the fucking CZ-75 that can't fire very fast, ain't ya? Just make sure we're reloaded. Now that I remember your gimmick... Ooh! Alright, we got a second phase of this shit. All right, all right. Let's just fill you full flight as much as we can, then. Shit. Shit. So we can't do... I'm sorry for that attack being as loud as it is. Oh! Oh, have I broken you? Have I broken you? Holy shit! Okay! Noted. Don't make me say it again. I'm a... She broke me. Damn. So that basic gimmick of when she's in the light, you're fine to fight her? That's... that's the basic mechanics. Look, I'm a cleaner. I can feel no remorse from seeing a dead body. Woo! Ow, that hurts! But that's what the game asks me to do. Let's see if there's anything we can do. How much blood can we fit in this? Also, let's make sure I wasn't doing anything wrong. Okay. So now we have. Hmm. So speed for sure, criticals for sure. I am a Blackburn too. Let's just make sure. Let me let me just double check that there wasn't anything I could have been doing better. Okay, so apparently there is a stamina ring that we don't have quite yet. That's what I'm getting. Wait, wait. Hold on. Did I miss an item? Stamina ring. Just gotta be sure. Where is it? Oh, fuck. We didn't get it at the gas station. Whoops. We aren't going back. Yeah. Yeah, fuck him. That's, that's not a thing we're going to do tonight. But just know that the truck puzzle was 100% to get a ring.
but this is what we're supposed to do. So apparently, the name of the game is also just stunning her, which that I can do. Don't, d that didn't happen. That didn't count. Rookie, rookie luck. Now the good news is that because the mechanics are the way they are in Killer7, we can just do this as many times as it takes without a game over, game over. I was just a bit particular about maybe not letting, uh, maybe not letting Garcian die, because I wasn't, I'm not sure what happens when the person whose skill set it is to revive you dies. Oh shit. Okay, let's fucking go. Can't wait to kill anime. Stop shooting. You thought I'd have a clever comeback? You're new here. Which, I mean, looking at my numbers, yeah. Probably. Probably. Apparently Demon Shot actually does a little bit on her. Okay, sometimes she gets a full barrage off, and that's okay. So I do like how this turns standard combat on its head, with like, eyeing the invisible opponent. You came here to kill anime, not make, not uh, make a man in May. I did not want to make a man in anyone. Am Lepo. Am Lebenian. Just being punny today? Good. Good. That's what I like to see. Also, howdy, Trixie. How are you doing tonight? It is shockingly easy to just hit her in the leg. I think that might be my go-to for her. You're doing good? That's good. That's great. I'd actually prefer to move out more towards the center so that I have a better shot on shots like this. Just seeing mint chocolate chip, mint and chip ice cream? Good. Good. That's the good shit. Anyone who tells you it's nasty is lying through their teeth. That is certainly an attack. That is certainly an attack. Shit. 
Oh god. I swapped to mask on accident. But you know what? You know what? He's durable. Maybe not for this fight, though. Wait, no. That's Kevin, not... Coyote. Damn it. Okay. What? What the fuck? No. No. There we go, through the bug! Get fucked, anime girl! <laughs> On. Wait. No. Off. Okay, there we go. I want to apologize for that boss fight getting as loud as it was. Um... Let's just say... Let's just say it was a little tricky. I also don't know how to turn this game down from the game. Wait. It's weird that the boss doesn't drop anything. <laughs> Has once or twice. Fuck you. Okay, and now mask. To jaws. Whoop. Double. Blood machine's out of order, right? No. Shit, all right. Free blood. <sighs> Let's just save into slot, eh? God, I have to like reprogram my brain in the middle of a stream. Let's actually swap to Dan so that we have someone who will just shoot and not have like a weird gimmick except the except the occasional double tap also make sure we're at full reload noted i can i can pick out the the vague silhouette <laughs> Now just swap to Dan, and continue as we were. <laughs> Boom. Too easy. See, there we go. All you need is blood. And baby, I'm full of it. Okay. Ooh. Good thing I saw you. Okay, he may have exploded that I don't... And I didn't want that, but... There we are. He was already got for me. Master, that won't do. Forgive my criticism. Forgive my arrogance. Lord knows I hate myself for this. The self-loathing is frothing over, drowning in my own pool of hate. Empty the pool, empty it now, for all our sakes. In the name of Harmon. 
Okay, so I have a couple ideas of how that might be handled. But nothing concrete quite yet. What's the road? Oh, okay. Coyote? No. Con. Fucks me up because they're next to each other. I might have to put an index card just to be like, all right, hot swapping. Who's who? Hey. Valve. What do we got? Okay, so we need a second thing. second thing be? Hold on. I think I have an idea. You're fucked. But nothing concrete. Just gonna call it a hunch for now. Cause there was the one room that just whoop. <laughs> There's the one room that just decided, like, hey, we're gonna have, we're gonna have Yoon give out a hint, but I don't <laughs> quite remember where that was. You're fucked. But I have a hunch that I'll probably understand what he wants. Well, that's not what I wanted to do, but it'll it'll work. It'll work. Oh shit! Actually, that's not as bad as I make it out to be. Hold on. Hold on. Don't make me say it again. I was gonna say I can use Garcian to get back. Okay. Whoop. Actually, we're in the neighborhood for it now anyways. <laughs> the world won't hate me to make a detour. It's just a detour. You and you still in here? You are. All right, so let's shoot the mask. Hello, loser. You're so natural and primitive, like a beast in the wild. I am the true mask. And I shall guide you. Four eyes to pass the security. Release lock in the bedroom. A job for the beauty. Blood bath. Never lose patience. Tomorrow, it could be you. Okay, so one of the bedrooms has a lock. Do you mean this one? Okay, so that one is useful for Khan. Okay, this place definitely ain't what he was talking about. <laughs> I actually wanna get a little closer to ya, so I can be certain of what I'm shooting. Son of a bitch.
<laughs> ah, good. Just the man I wanted to see. Son of a bitch. Because <laughs> I don't ever think I went down this far and into this bedroom. <laughs> yes, nice flashbang. This is one hot and muggy day. Old man must really be feeling this. Now where could he be hiding? Maybe this way? Nah, at this size. Only a kid could fit through. Okay, yeah, and once you're Garcian, you can't do anything until you retrieve the body that you mean to retrieve. So let's go and get the body back and just remember where we're going. What? Actually, was there anything even in here? I mean, besides this heaven smile. No, just a security system. <laughs> there we are. I'm actually surprised. I've never ever like with as with as wide a cast as this game has, I don't think I've ever seen anyone cosplay from Killer7. Like, I know Kaede might be a bit of a stretch with any of her outfits, but like, I know people with the physique of Garcian. I know people who could totally pull off Khan. Granted, they'd have to blindfold themselves. The, the blindfold, I can understand. But, but like, Dan would be such an easy closet cosplay. Are you kidding me? Son of a bitch. Fucking, um, Mask would just be fun. Like, you get to carry around two fucking comical shoebox looking ass grenade launchers. <laughs> <laughs> like, it'd be great. <laughs> Kevin is, well, frankly, I would rather not speak ill of people who can't speak for themselves. But I know a handful of people who have made some bad life choices that have that posture and that gut. Look, I'm a cleaner. Woo! Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, well actually, bet you could do a good cosplay of the girl who's just a head only once. <laughs> okay. So story time, kiddos. Story time. Um, for. About two weeks during Prime Haunt season, I actually was a disembodied head, uh, and it was really fun, because it's just like, hey, do you want to be paid for literally just sitting there for a couple hours? You get access to, like, a whole hallway that keeps you concealed from everyone else. Uh, we can have literally anyone take that position for you if you need to use a if you need to have a bathroom break and you can't get back in before the next group. Your scare isn't exactly integral. It was great. <laughs> oh. Well, I am sure hoping. I saw Omida, and I'm like, what are you doing here, you silly goose? And... Damn. Don't make me say it again. Yeah. Um... One person actually almost did get a real- for real ass swing on me, but, um... This is the secret, boys and girls. And everything in between and past. Um... 
most haunt actors are practicing for the day that someone swings on them. They are practicing the evasive maneuvers in their room. Um... And sometimes between groups, you have more than enough time to perfect, like, the perfect head duck. Yo, one of my mods, ban that sick filth! Yo, get his ass, get his ass! Hey, good shit, Nyx! How long have you been here? I don't remember you ever saying howdy. But yeah, so like, I feel a little mean since the start. Oh no! I don't remember you ever saying howdy. But yeah, almost every haunt actor is practicing for the day some doofy motherfucker decides to swing on him. So I like duck my head out of the way and. Uh, so there's a perfect bevel for me to just slide my head in and, like, rest my chin on. All right, let's take that shit. Well, Mido, what you got for me? That was Clements. He's gonna become a big man. He has my DNA. The teachings of the Yamako will guide him. My wife was a blur of risk taken. I'd suffer withdrawal without. The constant stimulus of danger. Garcian Smith. I'm just like you. You ever have to kill just to feel alive, right? Well, I have to be face to face with death to get my taste of life. We are both bound by our passions. But yeah. Uh, also, d d don't worry about next. I'm, like, razzing you tops, and I'm glad you're around. I hope you feel better. At least soon. <laughs> Doesn't gotta be tonight. <laughs> Shit. Alright, so now we gotta navigate back to the pool, which should just be this route. And if I remember correctly. But yeah, so he like good being around here? That's good. I wouldn't want it to be any other way. <laughs> Adios. Yeah, so motherfucker goes to, like, hammer swing down on me, and I just tuck my head perfectly so that he just wangs the fuck out of his hand. Fuck you. And this motherfucker's yelling for the... Because it was, uh... I'm not going to give away any establishment's names for, uh... For the sake of... Covering my ass because I didn't have a good work experience there. So if I ever say their name, um... They might be mad at me. Fuck you. Um... But Fuck you. let's just say it was a bootleg Chuck E. Cheese and it did laser tag and decided it wanted to do scary laser tag for Halloween with like actors in costume and shit. Um, they did it did not occur to them that um it may be Have a good night. Have a good night, Trixie. Yeah, it did not occur to them that maybe just maybe, um some people's makeup would maybe get on the vest. And if they're going to be an asshole about that, then certain actors maybe don't want to wear the vest and get makeup on it. Because, like, okay. Imagine this, okay? You have to put on makeup every day for work. Like, have to because you have to be in costume, alright? And... You don't want to do a bad job, so you do everything in your power to get into makeup, into character. And they have approved this makeup, and never ask you to change this makeup. 
and then decide, we want you to put on this vest, and every time you do, they yell when there is makeup on the vest. Um, but that's besides the point. That was a bit of me just bitching. Um, the, the person that basically keeps the peace and also, like, monitors the other group, because, like, the guide we had, guide for lack of a better term, uh, she knew that the haunt crew wouldn't do anything, but it was a person to break up fights, or to, um, or to, like, make sure a kid who, like, pukes on the floor gets escorted out, and someone to, like, radio in the, uh, the back room. Shit like that. Not quite a security guard, because it was also an actor. Um, he's, he's yelling at her and yelling at her. And she's like, well, what happened? And he, and he fucking t spins this fucking yarn. And I'm just sitting in my position, waiting for the next group. And she's like, so... I'm being told you did this, this, and this. And I'm like, no. In fact, he swung at me. <laughs> I can prove it. Because when he whams his hand down in that hammer fist, he knocked the cabinet that I was sitting in a little loose. So I'm like, I can prove it. And I take my hand and I just jostle exactly where I'm sitting. And then end it with the words, check the cameras. Because we had cameras. Uh, he was escorted out and told never to come back. I hope he has a bad life. Man, it's so hot. Almost as hot as that one fateful day. Right, Smith? The chief knew. Knew this was an unlucky day. It ain't good for the old man, either. Cause one dip down below and all the skeletons come out of the closet. Also, I know his shirt says summer. It looks like it says calmer. Uh, also, for clarity, if I'm remembering correctly, uh, his big lie was that I bit him? And no. No, I did not. <laughs> I don't bite people. Where to? To the Vinculum Gate. Let me take those. Yes, all received. Go right on inside. Um, so before we hit the Coliseum, uh, I'm gonna take this as a chance to be right back. Um, enjoy me being right back. Wait, what did I want to turn off? I wanted to turn that off, right. Either way, enjoy. I'll, I just need to refill my drink and, uh, maybe use the bathroom. It'll be a couple minutes.
Alright, I'm back. Just gotta put my headset back on. How is everyone? Everyone have a good break? Bleh. That's fair. I haven't told a soul. I had to make a promise. To keep it secret no matter what. Will you believe what I tell you? Do you promise? That monster won't move. But it's if its neck moves, you're in big trouble. Before you know it, you'll go completely blank. Sorry, just had to bump the tweet. A laser smile. I don't like you. Also, all the blood in this area, I feel like Kaede might be useful. gotten here. Samantha. Yeah, if y'all, if y'all have any questions about like haunt work or whatnot, um, because I have had more experience than most, meaning I have done more than one year. Uh, because the sad truth is with haunts, uh, people usually just do it once and don't come back. Even though it is a perfectly fine acting gig and guaranteed pay, usually. Fuck. Fuck are you looking at? Okay. So power and speed for you. Yeah, like, I fucking love haunt, act haunt acting. It's also a really good way to get your foot in the door with acting in general. Those girls alive? I heard them crying. It must have been forced upon them. The poor girls. That man has a glare in his eyes. A sharp, evil glare. It's scary. You can't trust a man's eyes. You must trust the pigeon. The last pigeon is unique. It's the neck. The neck. What? I feel like I have to be taller then? What does this actually mean? Okay, I just had to be taller and, like, viewable at all. Hello. Welcome. Danny boy, look at you. You've changed considerably. Into a badass, if I may. Yeah, and you've changed a lot, too. Into an old man. Oh! I went to see the devil. Now it's your turn. Oh, my pupil. So tenacious of life. Guess I have to kill you again. Shut up. Before you run out of breath. I oh? got rid of those smiles. There's no one to disturb our game. It's just you and me. Sounds fair. Because I hate holding back. Even for an old fart like yourself. Talk all you want. He has really pretty eyes. Like, really, really pretty eyes. Or four for you. 
will begin when the bird flies. Can you remember that? Pink ass punk, you're going down. Okay. Okay. Two? I can't say I fully understand. Go for the neck? Okay, so bird go down, on flight, on flight, start aiming, and then go for the neck. Okay, that's a weird fight, but I can, I can rock with this. Okay, go, go, shoot. What? Did I not... Did I, like, not hit the neck perfectly? Alright, well, the good news is Garcian is right behind... Or, the last Harmon room is right before this. So I barely even have to move. Okay. I can feel no remorse from the dead body. To me, it's merely cold, rotting fish. Yes, Dan Smith. There's something just very spooky about the fact that everyone's name is Smith. Like, you could not have picked a more. inconspicuous name. It is perfect. Hit me. Come on. Okay, so head also counts. This would also be a cosplay I could see someone pulling. You fucking faint? You son of a bitch. Go. Come on. Ah, that's on me. That's on me. Whew. Yeah, his posture hasn't changed when the bird faints. Fucker. I'm actually like, I'm holding the ready key like a goddamn burrito so that I can pull back up before I get a full key press in. It's actually kind of spooky. I mean, I like that this isn't just a shoot it until it dies attack. And it's like, and it's like, no, this boss has a proper gimmick. Damn it. Fuck off. There we are.
<laughs> this is really cool. Yeah, I agree, but like, god damn it. Have you never thought to consider my heart? Looks like this is your end. Oh, guess you think this is pretty funny. Oh, please tell me we see the the, the ooh. Let let me see the blood in the pool. After retirement, what do you think? What do I think? I think what you got here is no different than what those guys do at immigration. All I ever wanted was yep. to shed light yep. on my life. You have no idea. You're nothing but a sick maniac. Guess it's time to close the curtains. Trying to die in style? Give me a break, you sick old man. Yeah! Oh, fuck! All right! Okay, I didn't expect it to be this. Yo! Is he just a skeleton? Is he just gonna be a fucking skeleton after all this? What? Well, I'm glad that they're covered up. <laughs> oh, that's even better! Life, wonderful indeed. Fucking yo! <laughs> the maidens save the world with their laughter. <laughs> Continue to alter ego. Fuck, this game is so cool! October 2011. What are you? Stop that. I also kind of wish I could read Japanese of any sort so that I could know what that means. Oh, I don't like how the moon looks. Oh no. Another anime cutscene. No screaming this time, huh? Oh, she's even hotter when she's animated. Oh, that felt good. Talk about relieving stress. Hey, you. What are you staring at? <laughs> oh, I get it. You want to take a look, right? <laughs> Is it too long? A little bit. Is it? A little bit. Hey, will you stop? Tiny staring? bit. <laughs> Jeez, what a pervert. What? Yo! We got fucking Sentai in this game? Alright, so, calling bets now, I'm gonna be fucking fighting some Sentai. I don't know how many, I don't know what. But call it a hunch. Reporting live to you now. The reports are just coming in. Steve Sunderson of the Democratic Party has been assassinated during today's Congress session. What me? The assassins appear to be wearing costumes resembling oh, thank comic book characters. God. Handsome men. Oh, jeez. 
Oh, jeez. Actually, hey, did this ever unlock? Of course not. Yeah. This looks good, too. It really does. It does. It really fucking does. I, too, would watch a show like that. It'll never happen. But I will. Who are they? You never heard of them? That mysterious group of guys who call themselves the Handsome Men? I've heard that they're designed by the military to counter the Heaven Smiles. But what's funny is that they look like heroes from an underground comic. ZTT Comics. Ever heard of them? Anyway, the hype about this comic is that the story seemed to cross over with the real world. What's that got to do with Thunderson's assassination? Well, you see, what if he gets off about getting kicked around like that? Very possibly. It actually happened. Knowing how often she's Seven doing it, and how he calls her his story, dearest. Thunderson's assassination was updated in the online game. Who's the architect behind this? Well, I know for sure that the bastards at the PR agency, Electro and Line Inc., are trying to buy over whatever character rights they can get a hold of. Not only that, they're spoiling the creative interest of that industry. So those bastards are the targets? Actually, the target is the comic book writer, Trevor Pearl Harbor. He's got a place down in the Dominican Republic where he does his thing. Now, sometimes you uh, have to take the strong arm approach. Got it. Oh, and before I forget... Look, the latest issue was released today. Last week it ended with Thunderson's assassination. Oh? Now, according to the last issue, there's supposedly a new enemy appearance in here. Do tell. Oh, He's... Turned into a monster. Hey, wait a sec. This means that the next target is gonna be... Shit! Alright. The Killer 7. I... Okay. Sometimes I'm not prepared for the game to drop the title. Spoken word. And then I'm like, wow. That's not something... Hmm. Street. Oh, I love going down to street. Wandering in the Republic of Light and the Shadow, Dominican. Assignment number 38. Kill the comic artist, Trevor Pearl Harbor, in secrecy. I'm sorry, can you run that by me again? Trevor, what? Master. This is it? Yes, this. The sight I yearned for. The much-awaited R&R. &R. But we must not let our guard down. The enemy has footholds even here. The terror has gripped the world. Heaven Smile has reached calamity status. You must stay vigilant. In the name of Harmon. Why'd they give the female handsome men g tits like that? Goddamn. To make her handsome. <laughs> to make her more handsome. You could say we're gonna drop a major bomb on this new target. Thank Is you, it. Sir. I ain't making out. <laughs> Is I'm it too by. soon? I hey, can't tell. Something extra. Let me sing you a song. Uh, a song for travelers. This is a lost city. You must find the key. For your tranquility. Ooh. Ooh, I fuck with this song. But who boy does it sound too real. And if I don't, <laughs> the darkness will swallow you. And you'll become a resident All that I of the see. city of smiles. Absolute horror. I can the eternal darkness rules on. When I'm gone, sing me that song, will ya? Oh, that 
That's good. <laughs> okay. It's been a while since I've just seen a basic ass heaven smile. Ooh, ooh, pink undershirt with black suit. Hell yeah. Master, this is it. Look at what I found. I stole it from a defeated female office drone. Of course, she'd rather have me steal her. Use it at the artist's mansion. The mask is hot. Hot, I tell ya. In the name of Harmon. Eternal Darkness X Killer 7 crossover. <laughs> I would love if Eternal Darkness got any play nowadays. Like, please, Nintendo, fucking make a new one. You own all the rights. Re-release Geist. Fucking, I would buy an Eternal Darkness remake in a heartbeat. Kegs are perfect for building up strength. Okay, so we may need like a strength ring? of some sort. <laughs> no. This is honestly a much better outside map than the, uh, than the one in Texas. You want guys so hard? Yeah. Master, this is it. Look what I found. I made a deal with an infamous quack. Life is only what you bargain for. Use it at the artist's mansion. What's that? Oh, this. It's called a lost city. Go this way and that, but you're bound to end up where you started. Find your way using sound. This is a job for the punk. In the name of Harmon. <laughs> Hold on. hear that they're straight up full on nudity and geist? Yeah. Um, well, technically. One character has a... I will call it a vagina you will never see. Wait. Oh, you're the laser smile. What is that? <laughs> Fuck you. Okay. Oh, the punk is er the punk. Fucking Khan is like Daredevil then. Hell yeah. <laughs> Use an echolocation and shit. Would it be the red? Fully textured pussy. Yeah, exactly. But you'll never see it. A roller <laughs> smile. Please don't tell me. Oh my god, stop that. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh, 
<laughs> I was gonna say, can I at least duck into this alley? Give me that shitload of blood. Ooh. Shit, we gotta awaken Kaede. It's even fucking blue. You're kidding. Oh, shit. Okay. I'm a fool. Don't make me say it again. I'm a cleaner. Okay. Just a little miffed that I just realized it means I have to probably do the lost uh the lost city thing again, but without con. Fuck, 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 fuck. Son of a bitch. Damn it, okay. Reload? God damn, alright. Son of a bitch. You got blood. You got blood. Oh, shit. We don't have to repeat anything. Because we've already found our way. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> Glad this game isn't rating me on any sort of, like, actual accuracy with my attack. Son of a bitch. Reloading? <laughs> Fuck it is. I'm a queen. Sorry, I was trying to remember exactly what the roller smile was. Okay, so let's actually swap to uh, let's awaken everyone. I must defeat five more opponents. Hey, welcome, Green Bean. Welcome. Stream when you're awake? No way. It's not my fault that you're ha that you are literally across the planet. As far as my map says. <laughs> so five enemies, right? <laughs> nah, you're just excited. Fair enough, fair enough. It's locked from the other side. Okay, so I didn't know that that was a mechanic, that to awaken the other personalities, you have to kill a specific amount. <laughs> That's useful to know. You're fucked. That's useful to know. <laughs> You're fucked. You're fucked. You're fucked. <laughs> no. You're fucked. Oh boy, what do you mean, oh boy? Ain't nothing oh boyable about this. What's wrong? There's just a lot of fuck. <laughs> Some may say all you need is fuck. You're fucked. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Wait, so just a press and a hold is... Okay. Fucked. Shit, okay, Pitches, I'm gonna be real. I forgot that I had alert command set up. 
A strange flame indeed. Saying you're fucked like that feels good. It does. What about a water? Perhaps I will need more flame? Huh. Drink a the water. I do have the water. I can drink a that right up. Done. I'll actually put that at my side so it's a lot easier to drink. <laughs> You're fucked. Shit. <laughs> no, stop that. Just occurred to me how much I hate that they just laugh like Woody the fucking woodpecker. Gotta eat it of food, you would be Tamadochi. I don't know what that means. Master, this is it? Look at what I found. A stagnating youth held on to this for dear life. One must really live for the moment. Use it at the artist's mansion. Barefoot is ready and raring to go. In the name of Harmon. Also, let's do a quick reload. Downtown! Walking through the alley! It just hit me how much I love his fucking suit. Oh! Oh! Or his, uh, his Hawaiian shirt. Tamagotchi? Look, I can't read. And I said Tamadachi. That's, that's how you know I got the Liz Dexia. Don't make me say it again. Jeez, you still are an ugly fella. How's it been, huh? So Dan's the most useful in most situations. Awaken. Shit. Fuck. Shit. You can't write, you sent Tommy Nachi. Wait, what did she say? Shit. Fuck it. Same. Howdy Jess, what's good? What's good? Love seeing you around here. Hey Jess, did you see the announcement that I am at any time at any time now ready to become a VTuber officially? <laughs> the fuck? Hurts, doesn't it? There we go. Yeah, yo, indeed, indeed. Doesn't it? VTuber time, not yet. I need to plan shit still. I also need to finish this first. I'm a ghost. Let's just... God, there's something about how she just scritch and it... Woo! Granted, that's just arterial flow, ain't it? What a pain in the ass. What's the design of the studio? Editors can't even get near it. Talk about putting on airs. He needs to know his place. If you wanna know, if you wanna get into Trevor's studio, I'll tell you straight up. Gotta collect color samples. What a fancy selection of hues. The door contraption will open. The chief keeps a lech, right? He'd be perfect for the job. Just a guy for running errands. 
The idea of wrist bleeding always seems really painful for you. Oh, it is. There is a major, major artery right there. Like, you don't want that to get cut. It's why, and... Yeah, it, it seems appropriate. Trigger warning for self-harm. I'll... Um... It's why people that cut usually cut on the inner of the arm and not on the wrist itself. It? I noticed, anyways. Warning over. I am not going to elaborate. <laughs> also, you thought Kingdom Hearts 1 was boring? That's because it is. Kingdom Hearts 1 isn't good. Kingdom Hearts got good at Chain of Memories and 2. Kingdom Hearts 1 just has nostalgia value and a lot of plot set up for the rest of it. <laughs> Doesn't. Oh, Gabe did. My point stands. Oh no! I like Kingdom Hearts 1. I'm also just super aware of like... It ain't the best. Wait, strength. The eggs were blue? Why were the eggs blue? Why the fuck were your eggs blue? Wait. No, I'm an idiot. Um, I actually don't know who could be useful for strength. It's gotta be a ring. Clean, clean and kitchen in the share house. Fair enough. So let's just make sure. What? Okay. It's weird how we can run all the way back to the very beginning of the area, but that's probably... Found an egg carton. Two of the eggs were blue. Okay, but are they, like, supposed to be blue? That sounds like... That sounds like mold. If it's not like a robin egg. Yes, doesn't. Oh no, like old moldy eggs. Oh. Don't eat those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Most like edible eggs are meant to be like tan. What are you? Where is your weak point? <laughs> What the fuck are you? They didn't tell you about... <laughs> You've missed a lot of this LP, but what do I think of the game? I get more positive about it every part. I would not be continuing it if I hated it. Unless it was funny hate. Then I can actually think of an excuse. <laughs> I think the game truly clicked with me when I solved a puzzle when I'm like, wait, three people, one god. And then the door opened. <laughs> like, that's when I feel like I was clued in officially to this game's brand of shit. That's good to hear. It really is. What what the fuck was that Christianity puzzle? Nah. So like there uh So like level 3 or er, contract 3 cloud man, if I remember correctly. The uh it it was the one that's like take out the guy that's running the town in Texas. Um and he has a god complex. So one of the puzzles is like how many people are in this specific thing 
And there are four humans. But there are... Or there are four humanoid beings. But there's... But since he has a god complex, he does not see himself as people. <laughs> it was weird, but like... But like, I just straight up went on air and I'm like, wait a minute. Three humans. Because there's one god. Stop that. Alleyway. Alleyway. Hurts, doesn't it? <laughs> Let's get as much blood as we can, then. Game reminds you of a light gun game. It basically plays like one. It plays like one if you actually had control of where you were going. <laughs> and as someone who likes rail shooters, who oh boy does that feel Thanks, weird. Doesn't. Hurts, doesn't it? Like, most people, like, just frankly. This is gonna sound hilarious. Most people don't usually like railgun shooters. They just play railgun shooters. Or, er, not railgun shooters, light gun shooters, which are also rail shooters. Um, but I am like an active fan of the whole genre to the point where there is a light gun game that I want a cabinet of that I know I'll never get. Because there's none in the fucking states. Ain't no way. Master. This is it. Look at what I found. Discarded by bickering lovers. Love can shatter like glass. Use it at the artist's mansion. This is a job for the thief. In the name of Harmon. Obtain the color samples. Alright, so we need to be... Coyote. It'd be pretty cool to see a Killer7 rail shooter in an arcade. I don't know if it would work. Like, like I'm thinking about it and it's like, I don't, cause like, hear me out, okay? It's like almost everyone, you've liked every single one you've played, especially House of the Dead 1. <laughs> House of the Dead 1's really good. I'm, I'm like, actively hyped for that remake on the Switch. I really want to play it when it releases. Speaking of which, if you didn't know that was happening, look it up. It looks amazing. They even kept the campy dialogue. They just redubbed it. But yeah, I know like the majority of people that are like, oh yeah, no, nah, I like Time Crisis, or Virtual Cop, or, um, <laughs> or, or House of the Dead, and I'm sitting here like, yeah, but were you one of the real ones who were buying rail shooters for the Wii, because you can't relive those, because you can't relive them anywhere else unless you want to spend obscene amounts of money. Also, you should buy House of the Dead Overkill, literally, like, if you are listening to this, if you are within earshot of me, buy and play House of the Dead Overkill. It is available on PC and the Wii. The PC port is good. It's just under typing of the Dead Overkill, but it has House of the Dead Overkill in it, too. Straight up. This is a pain, man. Running around for some fucking color samples. 
That makes it worse. This town's a mess. That... That's what makes it worse. Have you heard? About the devil's shortcut? Word on the street is that, uh... Next to the door to the artist's house is an entrance to a labyrinth. Light the lamp and the shortcut is revealed. Is that spooky enough for that, Chief? Would you light the lamp? Uh, do you have a Wii? Yes. I do. Uh, I just can't record off of it. I would need a Wii U. Uh, there's one that you don't know that basically had connect controls that worked so you could look around corners and duck behind cover and you had an SMG. Rise of Nightmares? I know that had rail shooter like controls if you controlled it like that. <laughs> I'm gonna be real, if there were any rail shooters on the Kinect, I don't know them. I did not buy a Kinect, it had nothing for me. Even when we got our Xbox One. Bye -bye. Ooh. Wait. Now, I would love to get my hands on a Wii U for the channel. Uh, it, that's something that I would buy just right off as a work expense. You're fucked. The thing you were talking about was a cabinet. Oh! Okay, so I don't know what you're talking about exactly, but I swear I've seen it around because I've... I've gone to a couple places, like Dave & Buster's, that have had the machine, and I can't for the life of me remember what it's called. Um, there's a really good rail shooter that's at, like, Dave & Buster's and most amusement parks that I've been in, that it's, like, it's a spooky, scary horror rail shooter that, like, you sit down in it, but it's a big fucking, like, it's like the Jurassic Park rail shooter. But it has, like, it'll shoot wind at ya, it'll vibrate your chair, it'll fuck with you. Jester hat piss you off? Does it make you want to hurt me? Hmm. <laughs> there you are. Thank you, Ibizaru. Master, this is it. Look what I found. I got this from a nun. She had quite a rack, I must say. Kid left it behind after a confession. Personally, Master is my only god. Use it at the artist's mansion. In the name of Harmon. Uh, what are some Wii U games that haven't come to the Switch or anything else yet? Uh, Xenoblade Chronicles X. It's the only one I can think of. It's the only one that comes to mind. Because uh, I would have said Fatal Frame 5, but now that's finally coming to PS4, Xbox One, PS5, Xbox Series, and PC. And I think Switch 2? <laughs> Like, uh, also, I don't know if you're a cringe connoisseur, but Devil's Third. Devil's Third is also never going to get off of the Wii U. There ain't no way. The closest we'll ever get is the defunct multiplayer that was 
only in Japan, I believe. Master, that was part of the PC. This is it. Look at what I found. Discarded by a flustered assistant director. He clashed violently with the real director. Differences of nuance can destroy relationships. Use it at the artist's mansion. In the name of Harmon. All right. Um. Speaking of cool arcade machines you only played once, you remember Star Fox clone where you had to sit in a big sphere that rocked around like a mecha cockpit? Found in Dave and Buster's when you were little? Ooh. Oh, speaking of that, uh, Star Fox Zero. Firing howls. Star Fox Zero will never come off the Wii U. Unless they rework it entirely. Sometimes it escapes the darkness. Sometimes it hides in it. Sometimes it engulfs us, keeping us warm. Other times it desiccates us with absolute unpity. Wherever the light may lead, what? a beast awaits. You shall be king, Traveler. What? What? Okay. Okay. <laughs> You're fucked. <laughs> okay, this room actually looks a bit tricky. Here, this is a bit tricky. <laughs> what was the last good Star Fox game? Please tell you it's not 64. So it really depends. Because I think the last good one, as someone who as someone who isn't a Star Fox fan, okay? I I do not like Star Fox all that much. I have been told that the last good game was on the DS. If you <laughs> technically want to count release dates, Star Fox 2. Because Nintendo decided to bundle in the unfinished Star Fox 2, well, unfi unreleased, and canceled Star Fox 2 on the SNES Mini. Which, if anyone wants to help me get a sw if anyone wants to help me get a fucking SNES Mini, I wouldn't say no. Let's say I wouldn't say no. Because there's a few games on that that I want to LP, and that would be an easy way to set it up. <laughs> Like, uh, if I remember correctly, the SNES Mini is also a really good just homebrew box. Isn't Star Fox 2 on the SNES Online stuff for the Switch? I could look, but I don't think it is. I do not believe it is at all. 
Like, I can check during the next cutscene. This is too easy. This is too easy. Oh, so that's what Sway at that level's like. Ooh. So I can just... Ooh. Ooh, that feels really good. I think Star Fox 1 is the one on the Switches Online, though. An object, traces of destruction. How about I blow it out of the way? Wait. Hold up. No. Let's check. Let's check something. Okay, no. Time! You're out of touch. I'm out of time. Ooh. I'm a genius. An odd engraving indeed, although that looks like the pommel to someone's cane. Just starting up the SNES app. Oh, I am fucking daft. Oh, but I feel like a big brain bitch. Um... Oh shit, Star Fox 2 is on the Switch. Huh. I didn't notice it get added, but I'm glad I'm wrong. I would still like to buy a Switch Mini just for homebrew, though. Or, yeah, let's keep it at that. Homebrew. Don't worry, Nintendo. Nothing nefarious. I think they realized that they were never going to sell the fucking SNES Mini again. That's my going theory. I do not like awaking Kevin Smith. Wait here. How about power? Yeah, I'll keep it in mind. I won't rest until Earthbound is on the is on the switch though. The fact that it isn't bothers the fuck out of me. Old dogs should keep their mouths shut. I'll keep this short. The day I was killed by you. My long-awaited wish was granted. Those so-called heroes of fakes. Don't be fooled by that trickery. You're being sucked in by a fantasy. A world of illusion bred by a madman. Hell, what did you expect from a comic book hero? See you in hell. Ooh. <laughs> this is a track and a half. Is Curtis saying there are no more heroes? Perhaps. Perhaps in a roundabout way. You know, in a way, perhaps Curtis helped me kill the past. 
Master, this is it. Look at what I found. Today, the windmills stand still. A day of calm. A day of despair. If only we had that ring. Then that door would open. Use it at the artist's mansion. In the name of Harmon. Dan, there are no more heroes to desperate struggle. Let me actually check something with the color samples. Ah, okay. So we've actually got one, two, three, five more. That should that should actually be quite easy. But also, that tells me to equip the wind ring. No, fuck you. Hello, Santa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we're here to assassinate a comic book artist who also uh, approved a Sentai series that, um, let's just say the people that die in it have some coincidences with real events. Okay. I actually can't believe that I'm enjoying this game as much as I am. After that first stream, I actually thought that I wouldn't like it very much. Straight up, this sucks ass. Pissing me off, I tell ya. There are nine samples of colors in total. All the handsome colors. Match the request to colors and the door opens. It'll be a cinch if you just collect all the color samples. I heard the artist has a soft spot for comic lovers. If you knew the assignment of the handsome colors, you'd have a nice shot at getting invited to dinner. If you're gonna kill him, you'll do some stealing. Run into the alley. I don't like. I don't like you. I don't like you. Oh, you're a cunt. I hate you. What's the fucking RLM quote? of just, shut up! I hate you. Cause I feel it. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. The Windering Howls. Bada bing, dundle dungus. I'll try to remember that. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Lord, why do you hate me? Fuck you, fuck you. Tasty, tasty blood. Fuck! <laughs> and of course, because I'm small, you think you can bully me. Well, think again. Follow me into the alley, see what happens.
What? Why would I? Okay. Firing house. <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck that suit of armor. I got style. And two pistols. Mostly style. <laughs> Ooh. Shit! <laughs> Fuck you! Fuck you! Let's go, let's go! I'll turn my swag on. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Ha ha. Okay, so power ring. What? Please tell me that at least Kevin can do something about this. What am I supposed to do about the kegs? Hold, hold on. Okay, no. This makes no sense. This makes no sense. Hold on. Killer seven keg. Port city. Yep, that's where we're at. Killer seven barrel. It's mask, but I already tried his mask. Wait, but I already tried you. Oh, fuck off. Oh, I hate that. I already tried mask. I swear. Master? These. Collect. Please collect these. The creator's soul lies in here. The artist came up with a very solid lock. To break it, you'll need these. I'm sure they'll come in handy. What the hell is the power ring then? I'll go ahead and begin searching. Leave it to me. Just this once. Did you use mask and the power ring? I'm the hero this time, in the name of Harmon. So, fun fact, um, <laughs> the walkthrough didn't even mention use the power ring, it just says become mask. <laughs> oh, now we're at a point in the game where it's like, hey, swap to specific not only swap to specific persona, use a specific ring, and I'm like, motherfucker. I'm a little irate. You could call me the irate player. I dare you. Okay, I'm an idiot. Actually, no. I'm a fool. <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck you. You know, 
You really have to give the Killer7 some credit. They... Like, they might be contract killers. Hear me out. They might be contract killers. But they give jobs to... Hunchbacks, the blind, women. Really, it's just an all inclusive workspace. <laughs> you just gotta look past the fact that they kill for a living, and it'll be all fine. I wonder how long that'll take to bite me in the ass. Fuck you. But yeah, just think about it. Creating jobs for people less fortunate. I can make this joke. I'm a blind woman with bad posture. <laughs> yeah, but they only kill weird fucked up dudes. Yeah. There we are. Fuck you. Oh, college students. Can't forget college students. Okay. <laughs> Woo! Okay, I really like the floor finisher. Let's hit Harmon's room. Oh, fuck yeah, save point. Let's go. Also, their boss may or may not be a god. I don't, I don't know anything about that. I would say that they may put him on a bit of a pedestal. But they're also, you know, they also gave him jobs. Ah, shit. Okay, so this is back in the alley. Good. Okay, then that means I can loop back around. <laughs> You're not sure at this point, but they all do have kind of funky blood colors. Hey, don't discriminate. Some people just aren't high up on the Hema spectrum. Some of us. Fucking rust bloods. All homestuck knowledge that I tell you is against your will. <laughs> ah, power is not colors. And here I am making it about blood color. Egg on my face. <laughs> Reload, just to be sure. <laughs> I was gonna say, your move. I hear rapid footsteps. That means someone's either close or fast. And I don't wanna find out which it is. Fuck you. Reload? Too late, you actually like Homestuck? Oh no. As someone who's liked Homestuck since uh, 2012, I'm sorry. That's a really cool painting! I ain't gonna lie. I would actually pay for an Iwazaru painting. Master, this is it? Look at what I found. I beat out a hairy chested model for a job as a subject for a painting. And this was my payment. Master, stop it. You mustn't move an inch. The scene is nothing without me. Use it at the artist's mansion. 
in the name in the name of Harmon. Homestuck has a lot of problems, but it's more good than bad. Um, so Homestuck has a lot of problems, and a lot of it roots from being a product of being written in. Tw Fuck! Did I say 2012? I meant 2009. <laughs> I just associate the year 2012 with Homestuck. For, uh, for obvious reasons. <laughs> but actually, before we move too fast... That's all of them! Well, I'll be damned! Fuck you! But yeah, Homestuck is absolutely a product of existing at a time when the internet was much edgier, and people could tolerate a lot of shit a lot of faster. Like, I don't think certain word choices would be something Hussy would use nowadays. <laughs> Although, you know, Dave's kind of a prick, and people forget that Dave's kind of a prick. What the fuck? Did I just like rest my elbow on my fucking. Eh, fair enough. They dropped the R slur a lot early on. That that's the word I meant specifically. But like I also firmly believe that uh Hussy should have been fighting us a lot earlier. Cause there are some people in this fucking fandom that have that have pretty much ruined the outside perception of the entire thing. Uh, despite how, as individuals, most Homestuck fans aren't fucking nuts and know how to behave. But it's like, I love Homestuck. Like, <laughs> motherfucker, I took my name from it. Fuck you. And have cosplayed the character of that namesake. It's actually a really good cosplay, too, if I do say so myself. I just kind of forgot the wrist wraps uh, back home. So the pictures <laughs> I have of her are not entirely comics accurate, but whatever. Shitty Homestuck fans ended Homestuck 2. It's not done. Uh, it's been outright stated that Hussy is like, all right, so because you motherfuckers don't know how to act, I am just going to finish it. And it will be published when it's done. Fuck you. This just ain't right. Is it? Is it right for the time to march on like this? We all know the guy owes his success to his representative's finesse. He doesn't have the skill to make it on his own. Thank you. Straight up, he puts an angle on it on a comic, and the same shit goes down in the real three-dimensional world. The guy's a seer, man. No surprise, he's a little egotistic. He thinks the world is putty in his hands. But damn, never piss off your reps. They'll cut your pay. In his case, they send an assassin after him. Oh, I get it. That's where you come in, huh, Chief? It all makes too much damn sense. Yeah, no, sorry, I misspoke. I... I know that Hussy isn't making Homestuck 2, but I also legitimately forgot that, like, Homestuck 2 existed. <laughs> like... Forgive me for forgetting that the that the webcomic where they name a character Yiffany uh, exists. But yeah, the team is going to work on it. Uh, I actually don't know what the release model is going to be. I just kind of assumed that it would be like they'd release it in chunks. Like they used to, but like the whole thing would be complete first. And like, frankly... Um, Homestuck fans don't know how to act. And need to stop harassing the people that make things. 
I mean, that could be... That could be thrown at everyone, but... <laughs> or every fandom, but, like... Homestuck's been doing it for the longest time and getting away scot-free, and I'm tired of it. It's why I only associate with my local cosplay community, and by local, I mean, like, this state and the surrounding states, everything else I am separated from because I can't stand the Homestuck fandom at large. And it sucks. Because I've been in this fandom longer than most. I actually don't know where I'm going. <laughs> but it's like the this is me making an open letter to to most fandoms. Learn how to act. <laughs> Wash your ass. Oh no. Or that'll happen to ya. Also, use makeup wipes. Don't bathe your makeup off. Especially if it's paint, dumbass. Don't make me say it again. The shittiest parts of a fandom are usually the most vocal. Yeah, but hear me out. The most vocal part of the fandom has been doing it for too damn long. Unchecked. I say this with love for the source material. It's one of the few things where, like, the fandom hasn't ruined it for me. I can still enjoy it, even though the people that like it are usually shitty. Because I've found the one section that isn't, and will kick the people who are terrible out. <laughs> Shit, I'm going the wrong way. Like, my local scene used to have shitty people in it, and then didn't. Okay, I don't know which way I went. I need to find the part of the church. Okay. Travis? Harmon's room. Okay. But yeah. I... I can still enjoy Homestuck without the issue of Homestucks. Because I can enjoy it privately, and when I want to engage, I know who to talk to that won't be shitty. Okay. And if you are a, a Homestuck fan that isn't shitty, doesn't harass people, um, congratulations. <laughs> I probably actually like you a lot more than most fans. And welcome you with open arms. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Damn it. I'll take that lump. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Woo! Fuck. Damn it. Found the body, at least. Where the hell is his mansion? Look, I'm a queen. There's still no remorse to see the dead body. 
to me is merely cold, rotting flesh. I... I actually Destiny. don't recall. Destiny. Welcome. Shit. Wait here. Let's hit Dan. He's got the steadiest hand. Okay, the laugh still gets me to jump a little bit. I ain't gonna lie. So on happier news, well, not maybe not happier news, but like on non-2012 Homestuck PTSD news. Um, and this might be a stretch for my audience, but I don't know. Let's stretch my legs to see if I have an answer. Um, does anyone know who actually owns Geist as a game? Like, who actually owns the rights? Because this game does have me thinking about how much I kind of miss it. Because, like, I'm almost certain Nintendo just owns the IP. Same with Eternal Darkness. <laughs> this is too easy. This is too easy. There we are. Fuck. You know what? Just start moving towards me. I'll reload. Come at me on your own time. Have I seriously not gone this way? Okay, thank God. I was gonna say, ain't no way that I've never been here. Wikipedia says Nintendo owns it? Fuck, Nintendo, do something with it. It's a cool <laughs> game. Just please re-release it. Oh, yo, you know what would be cool? Okay. I'm not saying this will ever happen, but what if Nintendo eventually is like, yeah, fuck it, Nintendo Switch Online GameCube, and re-releases a lot of the old shit from the GameCube days that they totally didn't take off of uh, Cool ROMs and Emu Paradise. Like. Is that perhaps too <laughs> cool for Nintendo to do? Now that, that does mean I am asking Nintendo to do any work. Which, fair. But like, goddamn. I just want to play Geist legally, come on. You can't slap me on the arm and say don't pirate my game and then not release it. I don't... Cause like, can we be real? Can we be real about piracy for a second? There is no problem with pirating games that you can't legally attain. And it blows that that is the only option for a lot of games. I can't play Manhunt 2 uncensored without piracy, for instance. Granted, that game's not the best in the world, but I should still be able to, like, play it. Fucking just throw a barebones PC port out, and or not even PC port, just throw the barebones version up on Steam. And, uh, and release, like, a free DLC. So that I can just be like, hey, here's the uncensored version. 
Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. Bada bing, bada boom. Well, like, I feel like my own audience will agree with me on that. I, I don't think I've ever seen a single person, like, in my neck of the woods be like... This is too easy. Okay. <laughs> As I'm gonna I'm be real with you, I might actually buy a used Game Boy Advance. What? Oh, fuck's sake. Okay. Turn my sensitivity all the way down. Coyote might also. Okay, never mind. Good enough. Damn, if only you kept your GBA SP. Yeah, those motherfuckers are worth money. I just have a GBA. It's Dan Smith. The man! Yo, how's it going with next week's story, huh? Whoa, this is unbelievable. You What's really up with your face? I didn't think I had such power. You're one lucky guy, you know that? Let me ask you, what happens to your problem? You're done setting up your audio? You have ascended? Oh, I already wrote it. I wrote the story, so you'll die. Hey, it's almost time for their appearance. The appearance of heroes! You better watch out. These handsome men are tough. Trust me, I know. Because I wrote them. Kill Dan! Give him the old handsome wink stuff! The what? Oh. Okay. Oh. 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 I suggest you don't get too involved. Unless, of course, you want to end up like this fellow here. You think you guys could kill me? I didn't know Killer7 had a sense of humor. It's Showdown, Dan Smith. Y'all remind me of Destroy Man. Hold up. You'll pay for Black's death, bloody psychopaths, Killer7. Prepare to die. Are you telling me that I'm going to be fighting? That I'm gonna be fighting but your stupid a whole Sentai team. I'll finish you all at once if that's more convenient. Fine! Let's settle this once and for all. Sentai battle, yeah! Yeah! Fair and square. The place will be Broadway. New York at 0400. Wait! I'm not finished with you yet! Talk about characters out of a comic book. Okay! That was certainly a level. Not a good one. But a, but a very interesting one. Well done, you figured out how to split programs into different outputs. I'm gonna be real with you. 100%, 1000%. Um, I don't understand that shit. I wish I did. Okay. So, I'm curious, and obviously don't spoil anything, but like, are we supposed to, are we maybe supposed to like, How am I going to fight seven of them? Alright, Broadway time. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. The military standoff in the skyscraper Broadway. Assignment number 39. 
duel with the handsome men, the Punishing Rangers. How do you know what they look like? How do you know they're awesome? I thought you were blind. Like, full blind. Okay. Okay. Light brown. Let's go. Dead? Okay. Did you see that? A real handsome boy. Did you see that? Hope you guys wait. Are ready. wait. 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 Say to decide where you will die is a gallant act. Bidding for the Hold on. Seven, don't you think? Let me I think that's enough chit chat. All of them are real and can be out at once? Why not? I've got the ultimate cards matched up. Let's get it on. What? Huh? <laughs> what? First matchup: Harmon Smith versus Handsome Red. Well, that answers my question. Hajime! 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 Yep. <sighs> okay, that was a little nerve-wracking. Con Smith versus Handsome White Pearl. Let's go. What? Okay, well here's the question. Our third matchup is Coyote Smith. Do I just have to Do I just have to have more wins? Is that all that matters? Hold on. Hold on. What? Ooh. There's gotta be like a red somewhere, yeah? Gotta be. Gotta be. Hold on. I don't understand. Did I seriously just have to hit him in a in a non-lethal spot? Or matchup. Kaede Smith versus Handsome Light Brown. Okay. Oh. Oh, that's dumb, but I get it. I get it. I have to make it so that they can't possibly. Fifth matchup: Kevin Smith versus Handsome Dead. Okay, I don't understand how I'm gonna have to be able to do this. Kevin doesn't exactly. Okay, can't use invin invisibility. I 
don't understand. No, but what's the gimmick? Sixth matchup, Dan Smith versus Handsome Blue. Hajime! Hajime! Okay. Do I just have to find the weak spot? Seventh matchup. I don't Smith think I get it. Purple. Purple. Hajime, Hajime. Ah! Wait. Uh. Chess? Ah! What leg? Excuse me, what? I don't get it. Yeah, I know I lost. But... Huh? Okay. Oh! They know who's a strong Oh! Yeah, that's something you can't do. Final matchup. Garcia and Smith versus Handsome Pink. Okay. What? Okay, okay. The girl's an avid gamer. Her world of games and the real world coexist as one. I don't... <sighs> nice to meet you, Mr. Killer Garcian. My name's Love. How do you know my name? Because what the I shit? The story, mister. I don't follow. Here's the thing. I'm working for Electro Online Inc. I create propaganda using media, you see? Okay. You're saying that they're all Electro Online's advertisements? That's why I'm going to bring him down. I'll make him pay for Trevor's death. Can you really you sound... Is that Tara Strong? I'll make sure justice is done. But in my book, though, you be sure to check it out in next week's issue. I think it is? I'm really glad we met, Mr. Killer Garcia. The pleasure's all mine. Love, your passion is inspiring to us all. I'll be watching you, mister. Uh, Kaede. She did Kaede's voice. Um... Okay. Okay? Thank you for playing. Game end. Excuse me? Debbie Derryberry. I have never heard of her. She played Jimmy Neutron. That's how I know that voice. And Coco Bandicoot. So that's why it's giving us that all the matches are predetermined and you just shoot the other one until someone dies. Okay, so literally there was no actual gimmick. Or there was no actual, like, control to the mission. Unmask your heart, then show us your smile. Wait, is... is it the end? Uh, no, no, we got smile. Okay. Hold on. Okay. Give me a second. Give me a second. 
Because that looks like... Okay, so we have two targets after this. We have two targets after this. I think I am going to save it for tomorrow. If that were the last mission, I'd just power through it. But we just saved? Um... But we just saved. That's, that's my logic here. Um... Let me check something. Uh, da, 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 da. so yeah, Minmo. Yes, 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 Minmo, Minmo. Um, so we had a good night. Um, stick around for after the outro for the raid, obviously. Um. So, if you stuck around and enjoyed all that, thank you. I appreciate it. Um, if you'd like to support the channel more directly, there are links below wherever you're watching this to the Streamlabs donation link and the community Discord server. Um, there, If you're on Twitch, there are also bits and subscriptions. Uh, there are also new links below wherever you're watching this if you're at all curious about checking those out. Uh, they're mostly like, hey, check out my fucking V2B profile, check out the Amazon wishlist, shit like that. Um, nothing super important, though. Just extra shit. Just extra nice shit. Um, so yeah. Uh, tomorrow I'm gonna... Let me, let me correct that. If I am up for it tomorrow. Because lately my emotions have been... Woo wibbly wobbly um i'm gonna next session of killer seven will probably be the last session is what i'm trying to get at but uh so if this is where you step off for the night have a good rest of your night thank you i'm gonna raid a cool person by the name of Chinoshin. Uh. As usual, same raid message. And, uh. Yeah. See y'all. Have a good one. Thank you.